What's up guys, this is Shivam from Team Zion. We are looking at two main things. And of course, these are not literally two main things, but we are looking at the current state of the industry that is Metaverse right now. Of course, before I go ahead, there is Elephant in the room, which is the Ethereum merge, guys. Now, since you guys are in Metaverse and you are already interested in NFTs, I am assuming you are really interested in what's going on with Ethereum, when do we expect the merge, and what's the current status. Now, the current status, guys, is the Robston Public Testnet, which usually is a major milestone that will undergo a proof of stake upgrade on June 8th. Now earlier, Tim Bako, he had uh, come out and said that we might see all of this happening in the later half of 2022 that really made a lot of people sad. But this timeline looks pretty cool. We are not that far away from the proof of stake upgrade on the Robson public testnet. And once that happens, we'll know how, how Ethereum works on on or rather how well ethereum works on proof of stake and we'll see how other things can be integrated here now the merge specifically guys it will mean the end of proof of work mining on ethereum network so you won't be able to mine ethereum anymore and mining ethereum is kind of where uh, high energy computers are used or in, in this case a lot of graphic cards are used specifically and this whole thing or rather miners are going to be replaced by validators now what does this do for ethereum and for the industry this potentially brings in more people who are interested in DeFi, interested in metaverse interested in smart contract building and ethereum being one of the main platforms or main places of of construction of these kind of things it can get more people interested who are on the sidelines because of the energy issues or the energy laws and that might be one of the most important things that's or rather one of the biggest impact making things that's just simply holding them back because they want some clarity on the regulatory front and as soon as ethereum moves into proof of stake that can raise a lot of interest from these guys waiting on the sidelines kind of where where they have to or rather where they are answerable to a lot of people right so that makes a very very interesting ethereum and i'm not just talking about the price guys uh we are not really talking about the price here we are talking about the the ecosystem that ethereum enables ethereum enables one of the largest smart contract development ecosystems uh, where people can come and deploy smart contracts and that moving to proof of stake will actually make ethereum much more efficient to build on and that's a, a cherry on the cake basically of of what ethereum already provides moving on guys of course let's look at what's happening in the metaverse industry where a16z they put in 600 million dollars which is pretty cool if you ask me a venture capital firm andresen horowitz which is of course a16z has launched a 600 million dollar fund dedicated to gaming startups with a focus on web3 saying it believes Games, infrastructure, and technologies will be key building block of Metaverse. Now, guys, if you have been in Zionverse and if you've attended a few of our AMAs or our YouTube sessions, you know we always talk about this. We always talk about how people are going to spend their time and how they are already spending their time, guys. They say, or A16Z believes games will become the dominant pe way people spend time. And this is something that we've been talking about for last two plus years. And a very, very, very good example is Minecraft. A very good example is Roblox. A lot of kids under the age of 15, they're spending a lot of time with their friends inside of Roblox. They are spending hours. So time spent on games is much more than social media and by the way let me correct that statement time being spent socializing within games is much more than the time spent actually on social media and that 
is an amazing thing and i'm not now at this point i'm not just talking about metaverse i'm talking about games in general and of course web3 games are going to be of our interest that's where we are but at the same time games guys games that's where people are spending their time then also venture firm white star capital they raised 120 million dollars for its DeFi and gaming focused fund along with a 200 million dollar allocation to blockchain gaming project that came in by framework ventures and both of these came in april 2022 epic games raised a two billion dollars to create a metaverse with funding from sony and lego i don't uh, what's strange is i don't have this highlighted guys this is this is very important epic games if you don't know uh, you might want to check out epic games uh, amazing amazing gaming company and if they're getting into the metaverse it's pretty interesting let's see what they can build let's see what they can build because right now a lot of ux and even partly the UI in, in the blockchain space is kind of clunky, right? But people like these, when they enter a market, they raise the bar and, and, and kind of more or less a capitalistic thing starts or capitalistic ecosystem starts to grow and that promotes other people to innovate and build better let's look at a couple of numbers before i wrap this video up for you guys minecraft is the current all-time highest selling game oh yes minecraft guys where by the way which is or rather zionverse is backwards compatible with minecraft as well we've practically focused on making that or ra rather enabling people to be able to do that 173 million average monthly players 173 million let me just give you an idea top crypto games get about 50 to maybe a hundred thousand active monthly players or monthly active users which is mao whereas minecraft alone has 173 million average monthly players over the past 30 days and the game came out 11 years ago yes that's what we are looking at guys so the metaverse industry is evolving it's getting a lot of interest there's a lot of building happening in the metaverse industry and of course we are building with you guys it's all about the community it's all about building in the metaverse are you interested in building in the metaverse do let me know in the comments below i hope you liked this quick market update in the metaverse industry stuff that can actually affect our industry uh, really 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 well so just wanted to share these with you guys guys this is shivam from team zion if you are not subscribed to our channel make sure to subscribe and smash that like button before you head off guys i'll see you guys next time